I think that design is the same as other professions in that it's not just what you know, but it's also who you know. Uh, and you can often find out about employment opportunities through your connections, the connections that you've made through uh, social groups and also previous work experience. However, it is a little bit more demanding in that you also have to have a per portfolio or proof of your work, not just um, a resume or a list of your accomplishments. I think our industry is different. I mean, at least the way I we look for uh, candidates to hire here, um, I don't look too much at their education. I'm more at their education level. I'm more looking at their work. I care the highest about what their level of work is, and then um, if they get if they get to the next level, we're going to do an interview with them, and I'm going to I'm going to see how well they communicate about the work that they've that they've done. That goes back to networking. Uh, you never know when your next opportunity is going to come and who it's going to come from. Um, and there's been so many people out there uh, practicing graphic design because they have the software uh, and feel that they're designers that it's hard to, to weed through all of those folks. So it's much easier when you know, you know somebody and you trust that person and uh, you can give them that job if it comes available. The whole idea of this networking is, is actually very important. Um, it's, it's one of those things though that a lot of creative people don't like to do because it has a bad connotation. Uh, you know, salespeople network, we don't network. We're too creative to do that. But at the same time, if you're looking for work, that's, that's what you have to do. I've gotten jobs myself from knowing people on the inside and I've given jobs to interns and full-time employees based off of a past relationship and of course their excellent work. I think that in terms of finding a job in the design industry, the, the smartest advice I could give anyone would be to, to say go ahead and start designing things. Design things for people, clients, um, even, if it's, even if it's family. Um, start putting things in your portfolio that have a client uh, attached to them. Your portfolio when you're a designer is everything. It's your resume, it's who you are. As long as you are constantly working on, uh, you know, refining that and showing your best work and showing, you know, a breadth of work, you know, that's what's going to get you somewhere. There's nothing more telling than an assignment that was given to you by a client that has real demands, demands such that you're not going to get paid if they're not happy with them. I'd say definitely don't back down on the job that you want and, and to keep coming at it and don't settle. So one of the things I'd say is find out about the agency, the position, the decision maker and use it to your advantage without coming across as a stalker. You know, in one way that it's different is you can usually get away with a lot more and be a little bit more creative than you can in, in some of the more traditional roles and other occupations. Going to community events, um, being a part of the community, um, it's those relationships that you form at those things. Even even when you're in school, there you know you'll uh, your your peers are going to be key maybe in the future for finding finding work or or getting that next job. Or, or so you you really want to be careful that you're never burning bridges. I kind of have to say have the best portfolio that can you can possibly make, because your portfolio says more about your work than a, you know your resume can because when people are looking for a designer they tend to look at your portfolio and what your portfolio has, the quality of your work, the variety of your work and what you're actually capable of. Resume is good for a lot of jobs but I find that especially when you're trying to find work in the creative field people expect to see your portfolio and they expect to see really good things out of it.